everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I hope that you're all doing well. It's Evanis, my real name is Talia and I come from Greece. Today I'm going to the cinema in order to attend the live viewing of Permission to Dance on stage and I'm taking you with me. I'm so excited to watch BTS on stage after such a long time and I'm so grateful that this concert is being broadcasted to many countries around the world. As soon as I found out that it will be broadcasted in Thessaloniki, where I live, I booked my ticket and decided to film this vlog for you. The only thing you have to do is sit back and keep watching. Hey, how are you? Good? Good. Um, I'd like to inform you that I couldn't use my camera inside the theater, inside uh, the mall. So everything that you're going to see, all the clips that I have filmed from the concert are all taken with my phone. 
so I'm sorry if the quality is not very good. I'm sorry if I haven't captured any details, but I'm pretty sure that the whole atmosphere, the whole mood of the concert are 100% captured. That's it, you can keep watching. See you later!
before I close this video, I would like to thank BTS for everything they have done for ARMY. I'm filming the day after the concert, but the feelings are still so intense. I'm still immersed by the whole concert experience. Let me just mention that I cried about four times during the ARMY time only. Um, yeah, I don't remember how many times I cried during the whole concert. Um, it was quite of a roller coaster of emotions to me. What made me really emotional was the fact that I could see them all performing on stage again and they were so happy to reunite with ARMY. They were just so powerful, so confident once again and I was so happy to see them like that. Besides, I'm struggling with several issues with anxiety and with overthinking and stuff and I would avoid watching music videos or clips of them. I was feeling like I couldn't I didn't want to put effort on loving myself, on accepting myself and showing who I really am or showing my true self, my true colors without being ashamed of who I am. And yesterday that I saw how happy and confident they were on stage, I realized how much these people have offered to me, how much I owe them. And they truly helped me to see clearly and take this concert as a motivational force to me in order to show more of who I am without thinking what others might say and sharing love without being anxious about it or reserved as I used to be before I met them. These people have truly changed my life and I thank them for everything. Yeah. Um, I don't know what else to say. I just think that this concert was one of the most wonderful experiences I've ever had in my life. And I would love to see them in person once again soon. But this is not something I can control and this is not something that they can fully control. Needless to say that they did an amazing job, they were exceptional performers as always and I believe this was one of the best, if not the best, concert they've ever had. All the performances were amazing, spectacular, awesome, each one of them was performing in their own unique way, they worked really hard, we are all so proud of them and I just hope that they're staying safe, healthy and mainly happy. They deserve it. And I thank them for one more thing, for helping me reunite with ARMY, talk to some of my acquaintances. I haven't seen them in such a long time. I was so glad to see them. They were all so emotional after the concert and we actually took a picture all together. At this point, I would like to give a huge shout out to this profile on Instagram. She's doing such an amazing job supporting the boys and she gave us some pictures. I have mine over here. I put it on uh, my phone. It's this lovely picture of the boys. I hope that all of you who watch the concert all around the world either in person or in the cinemas and the theaters. I hope that you had an amazing time, that this concert made you more optimistic, that things are moving forward and I wish you to live a full concert experience soon if you want to and if the circumstances allow us to do so. I hope that you all stay safe and happy and that you keep loving yourselves and that you are being your authentic selves every single day. Always remember that you are enough, no matter what, and you're allowed to feel all of your feelings and you deserve to fight for your dreams, to dream, hope, and turn your dreams into reality. You got this. 
So that was all. I hope that you enjoyed this vlog, that you had fun with me, that you had fun with BTS. And as always, don't forget to leave me a like, share this video around with your friends and family or whoever you may know that likes BTS. And of course, subscribe to my channel for more relevant content very soon. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!